speaking of driving, number one on my list is literally anything in NASCAR. And I'm talking yep. literally anything. It does not matter how you cheat. It does not matter how brazen you cheat. It does not matter how unethical it is. It could put people's lives in danger. I do not care. If you cheat in NASCAR, I am not going to get upset because this sport, Charlotte, more mm -hmm. than any sport that has ever existed in the yeah. history of, well, I don't know. That's, that's a bold claim, but and, and that I know of, to my knowledge, no sport. Allegedly. <laughs> allegedly has ever had its roots in criminality more than the sport of NASCAR. This is a sport that was started, it was birthed out of bootlegging moonshine during mm -hmm. Prohibition. Cops are chasing guys. Uh, the guys who were the bootleggers would soup up their cars to go faster to evade the cops. They all started looking around saying, which one of us is the best at this? They started having stock car races based on these cars that they're souping up to get away from the cops. Um, I don't understand how that can be the origin of the sport. Mm -hmm. We fast forward to 2021, and if your fender is one degree off, you're DQ'd from the race. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you, man. It oh does my God, not totally. make sense. No. Throw it out the window. I don't think there should be any rules. I think, uh, at the very least, there should be one race a year in NASCAR are where anything goes it's like the purge race and if you're too scared <laughs> to enter it if you're too scared if there's some guy that's like i don't know man this seems kind of dangerous don't enter that's fine don't enter the rest of you guys but just you know get to enter. that you're a total whip you're a wimp, and I think it should just be like Mad Max out there, and just like guys, I don't know, put spikes on your, <laughs> on your flamethrowers off the back. <laughs> there should be no rules. Um, the, uh, it, it just it just baffles the mind that like that that is that it, it was a sport based on being criminals, and and whether you know, I I don't think you're gonna find anybody that's like saying that the, the you know bootlegging like moonshine is the biggest sin in the world, but it still at the time was is was a criminal activity. Right. Right. And now you fast forward to today think, and you got to fit everything into and you get, there's so many rules and you have to follow them all. So literally anything that happens in NASCAR that's cheating, I'm not going to get mad about it. I'm going to laugh that, that we've come this far, that this, the, the sport built on cheating is now trying to enforce rules. I'm I'm with you. I think that's the most beautiful. I love That's why I love NASCAR because I love that that's yeah. how it started. Yeah. Yes. That That is the joy of NASCAR. And uh, yeah, I, I like my idea that one race a year, anything goes. And um, I, I don't know how you, I guess, would... Conduct? I think also you should have one race Not a year race, where but... like the the drivers have to race their own their personal cars and Ooh, then like I love that it's idea. like the U.S. Open and so like random guys and women who like soup up their cars can enter and they <laughs> race normal cars against NASCAR drivers. <laughs> the diesels in the in the race. <laughs> we should have called this podcast agent agents of chaos. Honestly, agent, this is, yeah, I, I agree with you. For more great NASCAR on Fox content, subscribe to our channel. It's somewhere right around here.